Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. Last episode, I went... That was weird. Last episode, I went to explore the nether a little bit, and I found some stuff, like I know where the nether fortress is now. What the heck with that door? And in this episode, I am going to build a little fortress around the portal to protect it. So, first, what I want to do is build, like, a small little thing around it made out of cobblestone so that if any ghasts manage to get into this little area, then it's safe. Why are there holes in the ground? Take some soul sand out of the wall and plug up those holes. There we go. And, like I said... Cobblestone is the one thing ghasts cannot break, so it is the perfect thing to protect your portal. Because if you come in here without a flint and steel and your portal gets destroyed, you're pretty much just stuck here forever. Unless you want to kill yourself to get back home, but then you would lose your stuff and you'd have to find it. And if you didn't do that in five minutes, it'd be gone. So, stay safe. Bring a foot and steel every time. This message has been approved by Mayor Somebody. Okay, so the portal is pretty much safe at this point, and I don't have like any cobblestone left anyway I'm gonna need some more because I want to like make some doors here and completely block off this portal from being shot by ghasts if I knew how to do it well I know how to do it but it's really time consuming and weird I could make a piston door but the redstone could get destroyed by a ghast too. Why am I looking in here? I know there isn't any. I need to go into my hole and mine some cobblestone. Right here is fine. I don't need to go all the way down just to get some cobblestone. Why is there a piece of wood in here? Oh yeah. Um I could make iron doors because those aren't as easily blown up unless you hit it like straight on. Wooden doors would probably explode if a gas fireball hit anywhere nearby. Don't know what I was doing just then. Want to make sure this area stays lit up so that monsters don't spawn and attack me anytime I want to come down and mine. That's not cobblestone. Get rid of it. It's useless. What they need to do is make it so that you can, like, craft stone tools and stuff out of andesite, too. Like, andesite, granite, and marble. No, not marble. Um... And decide diorite and granite. Because right now they're just useless. I need to smelt this art. Ooh, food. I'm gonna finish making the little building and I'll come back and get those iron ingots and make some iron doors. floor should be cobblestone too because then a ghast can't like shoot a fireball at the ground and remove the doors just the surrounding area of the portal will be cobblestone because if I do it like this there's absolutely no way that a gas will trap me in here.
And there we go. Now all I need to do is put some iron doors here. And then the portal will be safe proofed. And then I'll just have to make it pretty and stuff. But for now, what I'm going to do is make like an outside area that'll be made out of nether brick. Why am I looking at my chest? Okay, I guess it doesn't smelt while you're in the nether. So I'm just gonna sit here and stare at the screen awkwardly for the next minute while this melts. Okay, it's done. Let's make a iron door. Convenient, it makes three. Um, pressure plates. I need pressure plates. Actually, I need to smelt stone for that. Uh, I don't need six, actually. I only need four. And here we go. And now it's time for stone pressure plates. What I really should do is set up like a two-way button that will open the door from either side. I think here and here. Not exactly sure what this is supposed to be, but one does it from one side and the other does it from the other. There. Okay. Now I'm just gonna make the area around it like flattened a little bit and like have some chests and stuff to store things that I find in the nether. I'll probably eventually make this my brewing area too, but I don't have a brewing stand yet. Make the floor nether brick. I'll wall this area off too and put an iron door on the other side. I don't have many nether bricks though. I'll have to go to the nether fortress and destroy that. Okay, no, you cannot create a button out of just cobblestone. That would be useful. If you can do that. I am one nether brick short from making this look good for now. Okay, this, sh this is pretty good so far. This looks kind of stupid in every way. Um, I think I can fix this. One second. I think it needs, so far, it needs to be a perfect cube. Dang it, not enough. Okay, I'll deal with that later. Um... For now, um, I'm going to place this iron door down and go get some more nether brick. I would build out of nether quartz, but I really do not feel like going around for hours on end to harvest it. So I'll just mine this little hanging over ledge of this bridge. This part is definitely being sped up because I said, like, nothing during it. And here we go. 
I am finished. And I have like, I have exactly two stacks of nether brick that worked out perfectly. I'm gonna run over here real quick and build some walls. I'm gonna extend this back. I did not cover the back of the portal. It's probably bad. It's probably not too bad, actually, because what's the chance that a ghast will directly strike that tiny area? Speaking of ghasts, where is that coming? Where is that coming from? Because whenever I hear a ghast, I panic. Because I don't want my portal to be dead. I honestly don't know where that is. It's probably outside of this little cavern thing there are multiple of them I'm hearing them from different directions it sounds like three I'm gonna go with three And I think I am going to be building the walls next episode because I have just about run out of time. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next episode.